Walker, Financial News Network. TFNN, Headline News Update. Okay, folks, Larry Pesamento with the afternoon update for TFNN. We've got the stock indices green all across the board, the Russell, Dow Jones, E-mini, and also the NASDAQ are higher. Of course, the strongest, of course, uh, happens to be the Dow Jones Industrials. Uh, NASDAQ is eh, it gets back and forth from red to green, but uh, it's still green right now. And the S&Ps actually took out the old high at uh, 4205. That's to be expected. Uh, remember, folks, tomorrow we're going to have uh, Stan Harley. Is excuse me, that's, uh, st our guest tomorrow is Jeff Huge of Alpha Insights, and then on Wednesday we have Stan Harley of the Harley Stock Market Letter, who's been suggesting that we would be seeing a high coming in. Uh, sometime here in early May. We'll get some more information on that uh, on Wednesday's show. But those are the ones we're looking. Gold has sold off uh, considerably after making a high up there at 2013, uh, 2014 and now broken down above the 190, uh, 8, 890 level. Uh, to me, folks, uh, just looking at these, uh, we, it looks like we've made some type of a pretty significant top in the metals here these last few days. And uh, we look like we're heading uh, to the downside. How much? I'm not sure. But there's a beautiful buy signal from an ABCD standpoint sitting there at 1948. That's down about 40 bucks from where we are. And, of course, in gold market, it could be there by the close today or in 15 minutes. But uh, it's going to be very, very interesting to see if we get to some of these levels. We're seeing great volatility all across the board. Stop and think, folks. The bonds have broken through almost four handles down from the high from 133 uh, to 129. This means higher interest rates. And uh, the market's discontinuing now because they think that this is going to be the last rate uh, increase that uh, Mr. Powell is going to give us, which will probably be 25 basis points, which would probably be on Wednesday when the Fed uh, brings their uh, all their little tools to tell us what's going on. And then, of course, on Friday, we have that big non-farm payroll number. It's always a joy for traders to trade. So that's what we're paying attention here today. When we come back, we're going to be talking about gold. We'll be right back, 877-927-6648. 